Hey guys, Nina here. This bonus video will show you how to add some more cool factor to the eternity scarf we made last time. This amazing flower! Now that's cool! To cast on, take your yarn and find the tail end. You have to start with your slip knot. Tie it on to the right post and make 10 stitches. And now, we're only gonna make two rows this time. That way, it's a long and narrow strip. So start knitting them on to the left post. Now we need to knit one more row over to the opposite post. There we go. So, do you guys remember how to cast off? You stitch two onto the opposite post. Take the bottom, slip it over the top. Now we only have one stitch remaining on the post. Take your last stitch completely off of the post, leave a long tail, and cut. So remember to grab your tail end and thread it through the loop and pull tight. That way it doesn't come undone. So we're going to make three more. Thread through, bring it up and around. And here's where the magic happens. You just pull this string, and then you'll see your flowers start to bloom. So I'm going to cinch the scarf first. Just take a separate piece of yarn and wrap it around the scarf a couple times. And once you've done that, make sure to tie it off. Then, grab your flower and thread it through the sewing needle. Take the flower and push right through the center. And then you're going to tie another knot to hold the flower in place and cut the tail ends. You just made your first Knit School flower. You can like my videos and leave a comment for me to see. I love hearing from you guys. And to see more cool things that you can make, head over to knitschool.com. Now that's cool.